Oh shoot, I'm on. Um, hey hey Jelly Toast here, back with more Tales of Zillia. Um, sorry, I'm editing attachments for my characters right now because um, I found out that you can edit the attachments and customize it for each character, so I'm just playing around, trying to make it really silly. Like, they really made this pretty in-depth. Change depth. Yes, I want it to be right on his shoulder. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like this. Whoa. Oh, but then... Move horizontally? Nope. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is happening? Move vertically? Oh, it's because his hand is... Wait, what? Change... Change depth. That? Okay. I guess it'll have to be there on his forearm. Okay. Rotates? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, R3. No, 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 no. No! That didn't get saved! Oh, damn it. Edit attachment position. I want it on his right arm. Actually, head. Uh, move. Oh, wait. Yes, rotate first. Yes. Okay. Um, move it. Move horizontally, move vertically. I rotate him. Okay. Um, change depth. Yes. I move vertically. I want it to be right on his- yes, perfect. Okay. Resize. <laughs> yes! <laughs> okay, um, oh, uh, maybe I should, um, the axis? No. Uh, select res- no, 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 no. Reset. No! Damn it! Did that not save? Oh, it didn't save again. Why am I so bad at this? Hey, KV, how you doing? Thanks for joining! And yes, I am customizing. Hey, Web, how you doing? Thanks for joining! You can save your set once you're done. Ooh. Well, let's, um... Do this again. Rotate. Y axis. Yes. Okay. Move it horizontally. Move it vertically. And change the depth. Yes. Yes. Okay. Maybe vertically a little more down. Okay. Okay. Resize. All the way big. Yes. Um, I think I wanted to rotate. Oh, Y axis rotation? No. Um, I want it to be straight on X axis. Yes! That way it's like a little down. Yes! <laughs> I want this! <laughs> um, okay. Change color. I want it to be a bit more blue for him. And himself inside and outside. Blue his house with the blue little window and a blue corvette. And everything is blue for him and himself, and that's getting more purple because he ain't got. Yeah, save that. I like the bandit on his nose, but let's change the color. An attachment color. I want it to be super blue. I'm blue, da ba dee da ba da. Or do I want it to be green or purple to match his other? I, think I like green. Yeah, let's save that. And let's go to Alvin, pet dragon. Where would be a silly position for the dragon? Where would be the silly position? Neck. Back? That's not really a back. Himself inside and outside. Blue his house with the blue little window and a blue corvette. Oh, just have like a... Tiny dragon on the inside of his leg. Oh my gosh. 
<laughs> Wait, right hip and it's inside his crotch? And everything has blue form. <laughs> Make a job. <laughs> Uh, should I leave it here <laughs> on his right hip? Ah, uh, oh man, I'm so oily today. Gross. I didn't even eat a lot of stuff. Um, I should move it lower so you could actually see. There we go. It's like, what's on your leg, Alvin? It's a giant dragon. <gasps> Change color. Mm, what would offset? Oh, how about yellow? Let's start off with the base and let's add the, that color to match more of his scarf. Yeah, there we go. Save that. Let's change the bandage color. Wait, um, yes. Position, head, neck. <laughs> let's give him the bandage on his neck because he's been doing stuff. <laughs> Uh, change depth, change depth. Oh, man, I need to zoom in on him. Let's see if it. Where'd the band aid go? Ah! Okay, that. And then we're gonna have to rotate it. X axis. Yes. Okay. Which means we have to move it again. And. Change the depth. There. Do I have to rotate a little bit? Yeah, I have to rotate a little bit more. X, X. Yes. Move it. <laughs> Have it just right there. And people will be like, what the hell is that? Uh, move the depth. Nope. Uh, move horizontally? Nope, that disappears into his neck then. Yeah, let's leave it there. Uh, resize. Make a big band. Oh no, then that changes everything. But he he had a big bruise. Um, change depth. Nope, nope, nope. Change depth. Change depth. I can see how people would spend a lot of time um customizing things for every single character. Change depth. I don't like it cutting into his skin. It's gonna be a little floaty, but whatever. Deal with it, Alvin. Change color. Again, we're gonna make this a bit more yellow. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so we got... Uh, how do I rotate? Got Alvin with <laughs> dragon on his leg, bandage on his neck. We got... Uh, Jude with dragon on his head, bandage on his nose, and we got <laughs> we got Mila. I need to not Mila, Mita. Tales of a mess. <laughs> Tales of awesomeness. Um, now I can rotate this because I know how rotations work better. Y axis, uh, Z no, X axis, X axis. I want the dragon to be hugging her. Uh, Z axis. Yeah. Are you hugging her? Yes, you are. But it's not perfectly centered. Uh, move. Move horizontally. Yes! <laughs> what am I doing? Uh... Oh no, wait, because it's in a weird angle, I can't really like make it... Unless I fiddle around with all three. I feel like I'm 3D modeling again. Uh, it's the biggest size. Change color. I want it to be kind of pinkish. Ooh, no, no, no. If it's a little pink, then I need a little green. That's more orange now. Yeah, there we go. Pink. Yes! Perfect! <laughs> I want to be bald right now on Mita. <laughs> Cutscene's gonna be intense. <laughs> yes! Wee, 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 wee. 
do, do the attachments show up in battle also? Because this is gonna be fun battling times. Um, let's custom set. Register! As one. Yes. I'll do it for all the characters. Register. And I could always update it later. Register. Yes. Okay. Now I'm ready to move on. Oh my gosh! You can see it on the overworld map too! <laughs> okay, anyways, let's go. Niakara. On to actual important things. <laughs> wow, their houses are so fancy. So this is Nia Kara. Huh. I thought it would be fancier. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to find more attachments. I'm gonna have to look Excuse really me. hard to Where's find I more am? attachments. <laughs> hmm? He went off to find Lord Maxwell and Holy crap, there's a dragon on your boobs! <laughs> Lord Maxwell? Yes, I have <laughs> Ooh, I forgot to put out my footrest. Uh <laughs> Thank you so much, KB, for telling me about um I attachment customization. To speak to me. I am unworthy. Maybe can I have Ball covering someone's face entirely? It's just like he's munching on their faces. That man reacted to Bell. He totally did. I guess she's the real deal. The next party member I'm gonna get, Bell's gonna cover their face. She's something, all right. <laughs> Not everyone gets to road trip with a major deity. I had my doubts. Oh, Jude is so cute. <laughs> Please relax. No need for formality. No what? Who's the next character I get? You say Ivor isn't here? Not my precious Elise? Oh, okay. How many more party members do I get? Yes, but he should have returned. Do I only now. get two more? We're worried about him. I see. He always did have a short temper. Please, return to your work. Should I place Baal a little lower on her chest so that her, like, his face is, like, kind of in her boobs? It's not totally covering her chest? You mean we can help you? I'm not exactly a religious scholar. It's nothing difficult. This is kind of cool, though, this cutscene. The village has four altars, each with a temporal stone. I feel like I'm one of the party members. So you want us to bring those to the shrine you mentioned? Precisely. Why not just ask the villagers for help? You saw what just happened. Except for my handmaid. I don't really fraternize with the villagers. Where? They can Why is me. the camera like, like this anyway? Ah, oh, the trials of godhood. Well, I guess a little physical labor won't kill us. Right, kid? We can handle it. Maybe for at least I could have Bao on her butt. <laughs> Don't worry, Jude. I'll explain your predicament to the villagers after the ceremony. Please be patient for just a little longer. Uh, sure. Okay, let's get hunting for those temporal stones. You said they were in the village? Yes. Gather the stones and bring them to the shrine. It lies beyond the village. Oh, I can talk with people. I can do a task for a person. Ever since Lord Maxwell left on her journey, the path to her shrine has become infested with monsters. We villagers alone can no longer contain them. Will you help us? Accept! The monsters appear in a flock uh, in the northeast region of the Niakara Spirit Way. Thank you for doing this. Northeast, northeast. Okay, but first, let me do stuff. 
I can't believe Compared it has been 20 years. World, I guess Nia Kara really is quaint. Why is she talking? I can't believe it has been 20 years since Lord Maxwell appeared to us in a human form. We must always see her shrine at the end of the spirit way as a holy place. Everyone talks about how great Maxwell is, but me? I just think she's beautiful. I like how they're saying this all to my face. Chickens! I can't talk with the chickens? I can't talk with the chickens. Uh, I don't see where this was, but do you have any items in here for me? 500 gold. Thank you, kind soul, for your contribution. Let me leave. Uh... Oh, I already talked to you. I don't think I could go in here. Nope. That is nothing. That mountain beyond the village sure is something. That's the Neakara Holomont. It's a special land where four spirit climbs meet. Where? I don't see anything. Wait, I can look up a skirt. Neakara really is the stick, uh, huh? I can't. How about we just call it simple? I can't look up a skirt. Damn it. <laughs> they say our descendants were disciples of Lord Maxwell and the very first settlers on Rees Maxia. I used to think that was just a legend, but the facts that Lord the fa blah, the fact that Lord Maxwell chose this spot for her advent suggests that it actually blah. it's actually true. Why can't I talk tonight? Oh shoot! There's a skit. Mira's hometown. This is your hometown, Mila. It's so normal. Mira, isn't it nice? It's so quiet here. Her waist is super thin and super long. Holy crap. Look at that torso. It's so freaking thin. Old man jealous. <laughs> uh, in Zillia 2, you can change appearance of the characters as a whole. Whoa. Mina into another character. Whoa. That's so cool. Wouldn't it be easier to put your mini map to rotate? I get confused when it doesn't rotate. Oh, can you change it to rotate? I didn't know that. Yeah. It sure is. Pretty weak, huh? I was expecting something freaky. Hey, come on. Did you say something? Oh, I was just wondering if your parents were around. Spirits don't have parents. And how were you born? I took this form 20 years ago. I appeared along with the four in the village shrine. Why? You seem to have a lot of questions about me. Just trying to keep Jude entertained. He was complaining about how boring the village was. You were complaining, Alvin! Jude, do you crave chaos that much? What? I, I didn't say anything like that. Uh, I talked with that person, right? Oh wait, I didn't scavenge their house. Ah, uh, I don't need any more apple gels. Do, 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 do. Oh wait, uh, mini-map, mini-map. Uh, system? Nope. Oh, yeah. Options, minimap, rotating. Yes! Oh wow, that helps a lot. Wee! Oh, now, oh, the world is such a different place. Ever since the robotic uprising of the mid-90s. We know it is important to maintain the pattern and the trails throughout the village. We must ensure harmony between the four elements. That is why we will be out here every day drawing it with our brooms. That's a lot of work. Are you looking to head out into the Zagat Flood Meadow? The Flood Meadow will always be a dangerous place, home to monsters that are far stronger than the ones near the village. Please proceed with great caution if you intend to journey through it. No, that's not the exit I want to go through. I want to go to the northeast uh, for the quests. You are a quest too. Oh no, I can't believe I'm out of offerings to leave at the shrine. The offering I like to leave is quite hard to come by. Would you be willing to help me find one? Yes. As you know, I need an insect husk to leave as an offering at the shrine. It symbolizes the transition between life and death. Please try to bring the rarest and best shaped one that you can find. You do it yourself! <laughs> Lazy bum? <gasps> wow, way to pawn off your work onto me! Ooh, mysterious jewel. How come I always have to be Ivar? All I get to do is clean up and run errands and stuff. It's boring. 
we're playing Maxwell and Ivar, so don't talk to me. I'm supposed to be Lord Maxwell. But I am actually Maxwell, so... Uh, you're being rude to me, kid. Uh, there's a dungeon here for fast level up, but you might die in one to three hit. Oh, shoot. When constructing them. I'll leave that for another time, then. Hit and run? Ooh, can't do that, can't do that. Mm -hmm. Visitors rarely come to the village, even though it is home to a treasure of unparalleled value. Lord Maxwell herself. You must be ever vigilant in her defense. Thanks, guy, for caring about me. You are another quest! So many quests here! Welcome home, Lord Maxwell. I'm glad to see you're all well. All thanks to you, Lord Maxwell. Wow! So people really do worship Mila. It's pretty rare to find Maxwell worshippers these days, but apparently they used to be quite common. Faith in the spirits seems to have fallen dramatically all over the world, although I couldn't tell that from here. The more spirit arts progress, the more spirits are seen as simply another facet of nature. So they used to be a bigger deal back then? Yeah. Legends say that it was the spirit Maxwell who created Riza Maxia to begin with. And the first human to follow him, Kresnik, came to be known as the Genesis Sage. So is that why they call the weapon the Kresnik Lance? Because they're gonna pierce the spirits? I don't know. Correct. And the people of this village are Kresnik's descendants. <laughs> Yeah, you get crazy origin stories like that in all these rustic towns. How dare you! Twenty years ago, I personally witnessed the advent of Lord Max. I feel like Alvin's per like, spirits. um, not what's the word? Purposefully being a jerk because he's gonna betray us. Uh, Zillia doesn't have a lot of extra contents like Vesperia and Graces. It was rush game. Oh, okay. Titles and side quests mainly. I see. I see. I saw her grow into the woman you see before you. Without ever taking a bite of food or a wink What of the heck sleep. is that face, Alvin? This miracle is proof that our legends were true. Want to tell this geezer about the time Mila collapsed from hunger? Just leave him alone. Come to think of it, the six ruling houses of Rashigal are all a part of that legend too. Their founders were supposed to be the six disciples of Maxwell and Kresnik, right? Now that is the truly absurd origin story. Those fools have no clue about the true secrets of this world. That's a cute face. I should never have said that. Please, forgive me. What just happened? She looked at him. That's what Nothing. happened. Don't worry about it. Wait, that wasn't a quest? Wait, what is this? Peddler. Uh, item shop? Expand. Uh, let's see, weapon shop? Do I have fishy stuff? I do! And yes, level 10! Regal blade. Uh, um... Oh, no one else used a fish. Farmer shop, you use birds. I do have a lot of birdie stuff. Yes, level five. Armor shop's only at level five, damn. Uh, oh wait, I said I wanted to update um item shop. Uses ores. Yes, I got ores here. Level five, at least. Nice. Um. Everything else is around level 5, so I guess I'll leave it? Unless I have a lot of buggy stuff to give. I do! I'll give that much. I have to eat food for a title, so I guess I should use it. Um, accessories... nope. Okay. Uh, heals all physical and magical ailments. Yeah, why don't we buy some? No, wait. I need to buy, um... Weapons and armors, if possible. Wait. Weapons. Buy... Regal Blade. Yes. Equip. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Hmm. Other helm. Pretty Ribbon. Ooh, nope. Uh, 
Wait, what's the difference? What armor do I have that it's weaker? Whatever. Uh, round straw hat? Nope. Leather guard. Lamella leather. Yes, please. Okay, mm and the food vendor. Uh, Jels, do you like scary movies? I do not. I hate them. Um, the only ones I were able to watch without being too scared, well, Get Out and Us were more th thrillers, and I wasn't really scared watching them. I watched The Ring, but I watched it in a group of a lot of people, and there were two girls who were way more scared than I was. So, I wasn't scared watching The Ring. I never watched The Grudge. I watched a couple of Korean scary movies, but, like, I watched it when I was in high school and didn't really know Korean too much. So, I wasn't scared, but then later when my cousin told me the concept and the plot, I was like, holy crap, I'm so glad I did not understand all this was happening. Mm. Uh, let's buy some small sandwich. Oh, I can only buy one at a time? Yeah, I guess I can only buy one at a time. Mm, I want a tofu cracker. I want a meat sauce. Oh, I have a meat sauce pasta. Yakisoba, heck yeah. Potato salad, yeah. Soda rice, soda rice? <laughs> Increases experience gained by 30%, yeah. Whoa, give me... Give me the soda rice. Mapo curry, orange. Yes. I selected items. I like more creepy or gothic kind of Halloween classes like Beetlejuice or Sleepy Hollow or Sweeney Todd. Yeah. That those I can handle because they aren't really scary. Like those aren't horror. I watched Sweeney Todd the musical and I watched the movie. And I didn't realize how bloody the movie was, because in a musical, you can't really show all the, like, slicing or cutting of the neck or blood. And so I was like, oh, Sweeney Todd is funny, it's fun. And then I watched the movie and I was like, it's actually pretty gory. <laughs> Love the movie though, it's gross. Oh no, the, mu the movie, like, was pretty, and I really liked it. It's just, like, there was that one song where it's just like, oh, we're gonna, like, make meat pies. And um, in the in the musical, it's just a guy sits down, and then Sweeney Todd just goes swoop, and then the guy falls into a hole in the stage, trap door in the stage, and they do that for five guys, and I'm like, oh, it's quick, it's funny, ha ha ha. But in the movie, they actually show them going like, <laughs> and like blood spurting out, and I was like, I was not expecting this. Whoopsies. It's a fake looking though that it's okay. Same with Sleepy Hollow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't think I ever actually watched Sleepy Hollow. I watched Beetlejuice when I was super young and I don't remember anything about that movie. But generally around Halloween time, I'll watch Nightmare Before Christmas and um, Corpse Bride. Both animated Tim Burton movies. Oh hey, you know what? I ate an apple the other day. It was so good. I really want you to have one too, Lord Maxwell. If only someone could go get one for me. Well, then I'm getting it for myself, you dummy. <laughs> hmm, so you want us to find an apple and bring it to you so that you can give it right back to me? That doesn't seem very efficient. But my mom won't let me go outside the village. And there aren't any apples here. Come on, Mita. Let's just find an apple for him. Fine, if the kid insists. Okay, so the quest was to the northeast of here. So I'm going to go up. Uh, only Corpse Bride is Timber and Henry Selleck direct a nightmare. Oh, really? Oh, then how come it says Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas? <clears throat> Wait, this was where the event was, right? Event list. Sub events. Uh, Nia Care. Oh, shoot, no, it's the Nia Care Spirit Way. Not out here, but. Because he did a short ba it's based off of- Oh, okay. Because they had the whole art exhibit at the LACMA, too. Where it showed all of Tim Burton's sketches and, like, original drawings. That's his character while he was working for Disney and got fired. Ooh. I see, I see. 
Reverence for Maxwell is one of the oldest and most fundamental tenets of spirit worship, and is rooted in the very creation of Reza Maxia. Nevertheless, it is a tradition that the world is slowly forgetting. What a deplorable state of affairs. I agree. I have no idea what to talk. Cow! Cows and chickens and pigs! The pigs are actually really cute, with their ears sticking out like that. Oh my gosh. And horses! What's the... What is this? Oh, I had to examine stuff! Duh. Temporal water stone. Here we go. This must be one of the temporal stones. I right. forgot this is what I had we to be doing. To more, just like that. I had to be getting stones. Instead, I was focusing on the sub events. Here's another stone. Temporal earth stone. Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't know where fire is, but. Where are the monsters on the spirit way? He said it was the northeast. <laughs> Pearl fire. There yes. we go. All four temporal stones. I appreciate your efforts. Let's bring them to the shrine beyond the village. Man, the silencing. So, all the arts that channel the four great spirits don't work anymore? Yeah, not since the silencing 20 years ago. That the sounds power creepy. of the four disappeared overnight, causing a worldwide panic. And when did Mila take human form again? 20 years ago. 20 years ago. Wait, are the two related? Yes, that was me. I reserved the four for my personal use. Seriously? I have no reason to deceive you. Of course, even I can't summon them now, so you'll have to take my word for it. I'll get them back. Oh wait, no! I was able to talk to them before! Now I can't! What? Well, this is a house I can go into. Assembly hall. Hmm... Seriously, save points everywhere! For generation after generation, our ancestors worshipped the temporal stones. And I can't help but feel that the advent of Lord Maxwell was our reward for their piety. Oh, whoops! Lord Maxwell is so incredible. She never eats, and yet her stomach never growls. How is that even possible? Well, it growls now. You all must be tired. Please relax and rest here tonight. Your lodging fees are in the house, of course. Uh, sure, why not? Let's heal. Hey, Rigo, how you doing? Thanks for joining. He also beat Dimitri's story. He's still not my fave, but he's okay. Just okay, though. Only just okay? I'm okay. My go- <sighs> I really have to finish putting in amiibo cards for Animal Crossing Poc- uh, not Pocket Camp, um, Happy Home Designer. Because, um, someone lent the cards to me, so I have to finish that. And then, after I finish doing that, I'm going to play through Fire Emblem like crazy to beat Golden Deer. And then get to Black Eagles to see just how great Edelgard is, because everyone seems to think that Edelgard is the best person. I'm like, no, she's such a jerk! Oh, this is Ivar's house. I, I came in here before. I found my charger for my 3DS. Yeah, I was looking for a long time for my charger too, and I was like, where the heck did it go? Uh, um, where is- wait, am I not in the spirit way? Oops. Event list, sub-events. I need to find an insect husk. Exterminate a threat on the Nirakara. What's a Navi help? Find an apple. But where's the Nirakara spirit way? Is it this way? Wait. Oh yeah, it is this way. Abu. No, no way. What? But so far, I think my favorite boy so far from who I, I don't know anything about uh, Black Eagles peoples. My favorite boy in Fire Emblem so far is Felix. My favorite girl is Shamir. <laughs> no, wait, not a student, though. Not a student. Favorite, favorite female character is... 
Uh... Do I have to kill this bird? Whoa, what was that? You have big hands. Interesting. No wonder you... That wasn't too bad. I think this is the first stream I'm catching of this game and the graphics are terrible. I mean, Symphonia is not much better, but this came out afterwards. I don't think it's too bad. Yeah, who's my favorite? Why is there a green butterfly? Who are you? Favorite female. There's not Ingrid. I thought I would like Ingrid a lot, but she was kind of boring. Um, there's Mercedes. I mean, Mercedes, Annette. Annette was pretty cute. Um, uh, who else was there? Hilda. But Hilda's kind of a brat. But she's, like, nice. But she's kind of a brat. Um, Marianne? I think Marianne's cute. Uh, who else is there? Why can't I think of the girls? Dorothea is pretty awesome too. Um, whoa. Are you an enemy? Okay, you are. What the heck? Give me an insect hus, dude. Ooh, shimmer spin. The name's Alvin. Don't you forget it. I will forget it. Uh who are the other girls on on Golden Deer? Uh, go back into town, look at the exit into town. It's a painting of a forest. Oh, is it? Let's look. <laughs> okay, let's look back. Yeah, this- this isn't terrible. I- I don't see anything wrong with it. It's just like, um, a quick space saver just to have one matte painting instead of, like, fully rendered models for an environment you're not going to see. Okay, ah! Oh, I forgot, uh, Jude has GP now. Yeah, but it looks so much like a painting, it hurts. You're- I mean... You're honestly heading to the next place on the map. Are you really going to pay attention to every single little detail about graphics? It's not a big deal. Rips me out of the immersion? You're- again, you're- it's a transition thing. It's not that big of a deal. To me, anyway. Um... How do I see what's in the middle? I can't see... I'm guessing that these yellow icons are... Um, arts? How do I... How do I view what these things are? Analog? Ah, recovery ring and martial art that heals status ailments of nearby allies. Oh, okay. These are spirit... Ma increases max TP... Ooh, what, what am I doing? <laughs> Aqua sweep. Oh, nice. Followed by a leg sweep. Okay, so basically I want to try to fill out these dudes as much as possible. And I want to increase SP for setting skills. So how about I do this then? Activate this. Activate this. And let's see. Dexterity or Psy first. Reduces the chance of being inflicted with ailments. I'll do this first. Okay. I learned one guard. I'll never use it though. Ha 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 ha. Okay. <laughs> Go! Don't get killed. I won't, dude. Ow! That they just freaking knocked me up. I did it! Jude, help me! Jude, help me! What are you doing? Far too easy. That, oh wait, I already examined that. Oh, there's a sack here. Nice. Mysterious liquid. Uh, uh, anything here? Nope. There's a monkey! Haha, <laughs> got you first. 
I don't want to kill the little bird. Oh, bye bye, little bird. <laughs> My sword rings false. Did you check your battle strategy? I did not. <laughs> um, let's see. Um, action. Uh, up to you. Target. Oh, uh, yeah. Focus attacks. Uh, strong enemies. Yeah. Uh, link off and support the rear in the arts up to you mm. uh, you take your meds not yet um, in one more hour actually I guess I could just take it now why not well I am reminded Whew. okay Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Link tactics up to you or mainly arts. Um, up to you, up to you, up to you. You smoke your weed? I don't smoke weed. <laughs> Where am I going? Did I come from this way? Okay, no, that's where I have to go. But I have to clear out enemies here. Okay, Hello, bird! Thanks for having my back on an enemy I'm not attacking, dude. Sack! Give me the gold, give me the gold. You don't hear me. Damn it, he heard me. Oh well. We did it. That fireball totally missed everyone. Wow. Just keeps Just keeps getting better and better. Okay, Alvin, we want you to learn. Ooh, arc fire. Nice. Um, any other arts you can learn? Uh, no, so we'll teach you that. Uh, SP... Sai... Oh, he learned Wigar too. And that one. Okay. I don't have to kill every single enemy, right? No. I'll just look for all the items. Oh, is he following me? Shoot, he was. Uh, linking always so the two characters you're not controlling will link with each other. Oh! Okay. Ow! Why is this bird hurting me so much? Jude, help me! And that's a wrap. Uh, strategy. Linking. Uh, link in normal battles. Link with auto allies. Link often. Link will boost up their stats. Aha! Nice. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for the tips, KV. Wow, he's still following me. Hello. I didn't think he noticed me. Mila. Where are the spirit shift adepts? Cool. Gabbit. Whoa. Here we go again. Whoa, that's also a actual PlayStation trophy. Cool. Gabu Gabu. Far too easy. Where are the horde of monsters that I have to do for the for the sub event though? Is someone following me? Hello. Okay, it's over. Seriously, is Mila I mean Mira born from a tiny bird? <laughs> Cause her hair looks exactly like this. My sword rings true. When she said she took the form of a human. 
Does she not mean a bird? Uh, oh, look! There's monsters! But how do I get there? Climb. I'm, I'm guessing this is it. For the sub-events. Hi! Hello! And done. Uh, that PSG trophy notification gave me nostalgia. Yeah, I do like it. The little da ding. I just love PlayStation. It's so good. Um, let's see. What else do I have to do for sub events? Um, complete. I did get an insect husk. And an apple. Where am I going to find an apple? Maybe I have to keep going? Or maybe I should try coming up here? Hello. Are you an apple? Keep playing and see why with the hair on hers. Ow! I keep wanting to use fire on the insects. Ooh, pretty lights. Because I keep thinking of Pokemon, how fire type is strong to bug types. Uh, rotten bone. Like, do I need to find the most perfect, beautiful... Um... Oops. I wanted the map. Map! 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 How do I get the big map? There we go. Wait, do I have to find the most beautiful, perfect insect husk? That's annoying. Still on the lookout for Eifried's treasures too, because I want more attachments. That's why you need to fix your avatar? Okay. Oh, I forgot to do that! Oh. I was going to do that this weekend, but... Other stuff got in the way. And today, I took a nap. I really think I'm getting sick again. L3 or R3 for Kitchen, I think? Ah, oh, okay. Oh wait, um, I forgot to eat food! I should eat food. Yeah. I need it for a title. Hi! Fight me, tiny bird. Okay. Ow! Who said you can guard? Alvin, what the heck are you doing? Just standing around. The heck? He was just chilling on the side like, oh, whatever, you guys fight. Serious liquid. Yeah, boo. Fireball! Thanks for finishing him off, Alvin. You're so useless. Sage, cool. Hi, fight me. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Ow! Ow! I never jumped, but that's cool. <laughs> Let us move onward. Onward to Frosted Tuna Team. There's a person there. Insect husks. And will it still not say complete on my task? Uh, ooh. More items. Copper ore. Why would copper ore be in a tree? Why aren't napples in trees? Yes, I do, Alvin. Fight me. Ah! Burn. 
Far too easy. That should be the end of my sandwich. Oh, but there's stuff to explore down here. Map. Okay, yeah. Hmm. Mila's, Mila's schoolgirl hair looks good on her. DLC? Wait! Schoolgirl outfits? I mean, school outfits? I can't get them in game naturally. They are. They're only DLC? Oh, I don't want to spend money though! The name's Alvin. Don't you forget it. Excellent. Ooh, I know! I love school outfits! <laughs> I feel like Vesperia had so many outfits. Oh wait, but I probably got them because I got like the definitive edition, which came with a lot of costume titles. Wait, Alvin, how the heck did you use so much TP? Ow. Shimmer Spain. That wasn't too bad. Whoa, Jude already leveled up again. Prankster! Prankster? For what? Uh, Lilium Orb for me. Uh, arts, 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 everybody, arts, 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 arts. Arrivederci! Cool, cool. That is a thing, that is a thing. Okay, so I've been pretty doing pretty well with her. Arts, 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 arts. Aqua sweep. I think he had another art this way. Yes, he did. Uh, vitality, agility. Why not? Yes. Uh, zoom out. Zoom out. Zoom out. Yeah. What's up here? Hello, is there an apple here? An apple? Leather cape! I bought a leather cape! Damn it! The spirit has the most of everything? Ah. Uh, maybe that's why it's the best one so far. <laughs> Except for battle. Battle definitely Zillia is so fun. Have not seen any of Eifried's treasures here. Maybe I'm not looking closely enough. But I think I examined everything here. Wait, did I miss that part? I missed that part! I missed these ledges. I'll explore them. And then I'll go to... I'll go to the north. West? Yeah. Yakisoba no- What? Why can't I carry anymore? Guess what I'm eating. I'm eating yakisoba noodles. Now give it to me. <laughs> there was a shiny here. Yep. How come I'm only allowed to carry one of each food in this game? That's kind of dumb. My sword rings true. Oh, I forgot to um, I forgot to whatchamacallit. call it. Arts me. What is arrivederci? What's Shimmer Spin? Hmm. Flame Ring. Is that a fireball up there? Let's do a Riva Derchi. Oh, it's a wind. Hold circle to cast it or release it early for wind blade wind sights. Okay. Uh there's always two Ifree treasures in each dungeon location. Like this place has three areas, so there's one Ifree treasure in one of those three areas. Oh, okay. <laughs> Da -da -da -da. Then maybe I didn't see it yet. Cause I'm making sure I'm looking in all the trees. Hello. <laughs> oh, I have to set Arriva Derchi to a left stick. Yeah, I'm holding circle. Hmm. Oh wait, no. Let me try using. Arrivederci another time. Okay. Okay, flames come forth. 
No, that was Fireball. What? Look out, Windblade. I'll cover you. Oh, I have to do this. Ooh, that's pretty. Although I'm gonna have to switch that for wind blades now. Um, I mean wind lance. Wind lance has got to be there. This has to be wind lance because it's shorter. Flame ring. I'll switch here. Flame ring. You can be rock trine. Yeah. Wind lance. Wind lance. Yeah. Whatever. I think that's fine. Wait, what direction was? <laughs> um, okay, Odivaderche is up. Okay. Jet black feathers. Oh wait, now I'm just back in the beginning. Attack. Yeah. Kaboom. Hello, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh, I don't have any SP. Haha. Uh -huh. I mean, um, TP. Ah no! This is the power of Maxwell. Okay. All right, let's go up for reals. Hi, bird. Stop blocking! You're not allowed to block. Only I'm allowed to block. <laughs> you must die at my hand. You have big hands. Interesting. Okay, this way. And I still haven't found an apple too. Let's save here. Uh, don't forget you can free run holding L2 without using up a TP. Oh, I forgot. <gasps> oh, wait. <gasps> wait, this is already Mira's shrine. I did miss a I free treasure, damn it. In here. Is this your house? It's my shrine. My house? I've never really thought about it like that, but I suppose so. Boy, you're really in the sticks. What do you do for fun out here? My mission is not to entertain myself. I do spend time reading books written by humans, if you must know. Sounds fun. Let's perform the ceremony. Uh, hey Zach, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Long time to see. Eagle so will show up in a bit in Zilla. Okay. Zilla? Perfect. Really? I was worried sick. But who's her handmaiden? This looks like the rite of the four's advent. Why would you perform such a ritual? Why would you just bust What's in? Going on here? In the middle of this ritual. Where are you? Undine, come out! Lady Mila, what has happened? I cannot believe it. So, why do you think you can't summon the spirits? Are they dead or something? Idiot! A great spirit cannot die! Was I supposed to That's real. <laughs> Are you Just playing this like on PS3? Spirit. Yes. A great spirit is that an ascot or is that chest hair? Yet its power transfers into the next For who? Um, Alvin? That's what they say. Nobody's it's uh, Ascot. Oh, so I've Ascot heard. is a like a <laughs> neck, yeah, a neckerchief. The red one. 
It's beyond your understanding. Hmm. Oh, well, that was the hair the from the, the four great from the dragon doll that everyone has on them. Impossible. Mere humans could never capture the Great Four. But the Four Great Spirits aren't answering their Lord's summons. If you eliminate the impossible, whatever remains, however improbable, must be the truth. If you leave an egg in a box, then somehow that egg should get crushed. The cause must lie within the egg itself. What? That doesn't make any sense. Good old house egg principle. You really are an honor student. <laughs> The Spyrex advanced enough to capture even the four. When that happened, I then lost my power as Maxwell. Mila? Now you will all leave. This is holy ground, and you'll desecrate it no more. You I'm need to one ordained calm down, to dude. Serve Lady Mila. You serve her, but I journey with her. You can go home. Huh? Let me see. How should I put this? You're annoying. Ha! Oh. Oh. Ha! <laughs> yeah, he just kind of busted in and started yelling at us and was like, Dude, we've brought her back here safely. First time I heard they were like a cravat. Yeah! I think the same thing, just different word for it. Um, yes. I think cravat and ascot is just the different ways that they're tied, and that's why they're different words. I think. This must be what they're all after. <laughs> now I'm gonna think that Ball's hair is chest hair coming out of her. <laughs> I have to face them as I am now. There really is no place I feel more at home. Uh, that lists. Where am I gonna find apples? Do I have to all seriously go back to that previous town to get an apple? Oh, what's wrong? I thought you were gonna rest. I would say the same to you. You didn't go back to the village? No. Well then, let's go set you up with the villagers. What is What's it, you? Wrong? Worried you won't fit in? No, that's not it. So, what are you gonna do now? Will you return to Fenmont to destroy the Lance of Kresnik? Yes. When you consider that the Lance drained mana from the four, along with the other people there. Ooh! We can assume the Oh, Zach, thanks for the cheers. Woo! The lance must gather mana before it can be used as a weapon. Uh, sorry, I haven't renewed myself. Give me a couple days. It's all good. Thanks so much for, like, even thinking of subbing. Time to go lay down and sleep. All right, Regal. Thanks for joining. Have a good night. One sorry for not being a sub. It's okay. Thanks even for the cheers, dude. One of us. One of us. Google gobble, Google gobble. And I don't stay up late. I, I will try not to stay up late. Thanks. I doubt it will be ready immediately. I suspect their mana gathering activities will continue. Are you planning to go alone? Stop beating around the bush. If you want to tell me something, just say it. Looks like I'm the only real fan How here. <laughs> no, everyone who comes and joins is a real fan. Just suburbs are super fans. Dang, I will improve. <laughs> You've taken an interest in me, haven't you? Bye bye. <sighs> oh, he's blushing! Bravery. That's not really it. I have a task to perform, and I do whatever it takes to complete the task. It's that simple. But you're only human now. Isn't this mission too big for just one person? I mean, you could die. I'll that just get reborn. Nothing. 
The task must be completed. You really are brave. What? Oh my gosh! You, thanks so much for the more cheers, Zach! Oh my gosh, thanks so much! <laughs> I just repeated the same thing over and over because my mind's just like... <sighs> Any other questions? Then let's go back. <laughs> hey! Yes? Can I come too? With you? Your whole life was turned upside down because you got involved with me. You don't regret it? Well, sure. A little bit. I mean, Jude has to go with you. Well, he can't go back. He's gonna be but put in jail. To cry about it now. It's not like I can turn back time. Now that I'm neck deep in this, I want to help you if I can. You really are a do-gooder, aren't you? Y you think so? I didn't stay behind in the shrine to rest. I was hoping to sneak off without dragging you into things again. That's why she told everyone to leave. Really? Yes. Consideration for others was something I learned on our little journey together. I think I'm going to go to sleep, not feeling well right now. Oh, snap! Okay, well, go to sleep, Zach. Feel better. Have a good night! It's not as easy as I thought. Anyway. Let's head to the village. Now that you found me, I suppose I'm in no rush to leave anymore. Okay. Okay, um... Just want to see if there's anything hiding in the nooks and crannies here. Haha! -ha! A sparkle! You thought you could escape me. Okay, nothing else there. Let Wasn't us... Alvin with you? No. I think you went back to the village. You're playing the wrong game. <laughs> no, Zillia's fun too. Also, hey Maka, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Uh, let's see. Okay, I need to wait. All the sacks replenished. Awesome. Well, now I need to really look, be on the lookout for um. Uh, I freed treasures. So let's examine all the trees again. <laughs> Fight me. Okay. Oh, oh shoot, Alvin's not with us. No, things are gonna die at pretty much the same pace. He wasn't really helping. <laughs> Not just trees. Oh, it's not just trees? Then where could they be? Hmm. Well, they're purple and sparkly, so they shouldn't be too hard to find. Hi, bird. Ow! Oh, wait. <laughs> Wee! Free running! Sword rings true. I think there's one on that boulder. Boulder! Boulder, boulder. Boulder, 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 boulder. Oh, I forgot to check around the rocks. Uh huh. Oh, oh. Forgot about these dudes. <laughs> we got hit by that thing, and we both got spun around. You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record, baby, right round, round, round. I need to look for ivory treasures. Give me more money, right round, round, round. Okay, now I'm really looking at the crevices. Give me attachments! Hi, Berg. Maybe one day this week I'll stream playing Final Fantasy XIV because I'm getting really close to the end. I'm right there with you. <gasps> I'm right there with you. Oh, thank you, Jude. Ah! 
Maybe I'll also record the near raids when it comes out. Whoa, what was that? Alright! Alright! I don't want to spend too much time looking for Ifrit's treasure though. Because this is just a quick run. Check! Rotten Bone. Whoa, there wasn't even a sparkle on- Oh, there was a sparkle on there. Oh man, just thinking about going back to all Tales games and 100%ing them. <laughs> Platinum trophying them. Oh man. I only used four fireballs and it drains my... My mana that much? Damn. Okay. Mm -hmm. Over already? Let's go, let's go. Boulder, do you have Ifrit's treasure? Boulder, do you have Ifrit? What? Hi, bug. Haha, <laughs> 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 I blocked it. You did not hurt me. I will fulfill my mission, no matter what happens. I'm right there with you. <laughs> I like hearing him say that. Uh, there was a check here. All grass seeds. Oh, I want I freed. I'm checking on the big rock, I'm checking on the small rocks, like... Where are you? Come on. Hop out, you know you want to. Hi, bird! Nice teamwork, Jude! Nice! Far too easy. Hello, Boulder. Do you have an Ifri treasure? No, I guess there isn't one here. Okay, maybe the next map. Yeah, I check. Oh, wait! No! There is one here! Duh, I'm blind. Hi. 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 Check! Mysterious jewel. Ah, oh, boo! I don't want mysterious jewels. I'm going the right way, right? Yes, I am. I forgot to watch Hero Academia yesterday. Whoopsies. I was too tired. Ooh. I should watch that today. After stream. Gabu. Follow me, Jude! Alright! Let's just run, rush back to the town. Which way is it? Wait, why is my map not completely filled out? What? Hello. Oh wait, there's a thing. Oh no wait, it wasn't up on here. Psh. I missed the sack earlier. Jet black feather. Uh... Should be another sack this way. Nope, no sack. Okay. Oh wait, another sack over here. Three hundred gold. Give me all the monies. I should save just in case my PS3 decides to shut down randomly. Sometimes my PS4 shuts down randomly. I'm like, why is this happening? I don't know if it's because it overheats, or my PS4 is just getting old. Hmm. By the way, is that PS5 design for real? It looks like a V you. on a brick. I don't know if that's the real design for it or not, but it's like, why would it be that V shape? So, you've made up your mind. Yeah, I'm going with Mila. It's not real? Whoa, huh. 
You're quite the flip flopper. I thought you were going That's to a render for the dev kit? Ah, oh, okay, okay. True, but I've made my decision to help her and I'm sticking to it. Is that right? Alvin? Thanks for all your help. Oh, I almost forgot. We still need to pay you. Ah, uh, yes. My fee. I ran into some hayseed. He said he'd pay it. Hayseed? One of the villagers? Yep. He was all, thank you for looking after Lord Maxwell, and you saved our spirit. Hmm. That sounds like the Elder. He shouldn't have offered. Alvin, I'll pay you myself. You need to learn how to read your people, Mila. They really care about that you. old man was tickled pink to pay your debt. You'd crush him if you refused. You think so? I know so. Anyway, he told me to wait here for him. That was ages ago, though. Not sure what's holding him up. He's still in the village, right? Most likely. We should find him. Don't forget to take care of anything you want while I'm still around. Once I get my reward, I'm out of here. Alvin, you can't really leave. He... He can't really leave because he still has to, um... Whatchamacallit, he has to betray me. <laughs> I really feel like he's gonna betray me. So what's your next Tales game after Zillia? I mean, you don't have to play it right after due to many other games you plan on streaming. Um, next Tales game is gonna be Tales of Zillia 2. But after I finish um, Mita's route for Tales of Zillia 1, I'm gonna jump right into Jude's route. So that's gonna be back to back. Um, probably after I finish... Somnium Files, I'm gonna either play Raido Kuzunoha or finish up Persona 4 Golden. Now we can once again visit the shrine without having to fear for our safety. You're welcome. I got elf ears! <gasps> Wait, Lilium Orb? Who has Lilium Orbs? I don't. I don't. Oh, did Alvin level up while um, he wasn't Active? Lilium Orb has expanded! Arc Fire! Okay, where's the next art you can learn? Ooh, SP. Art. Terra Rupture. Okay. Any other arts? Pulse Shot. Ooh, that sounds good. Okay. TPTP. SP, but this, I get it SP and art, so I'll do this first. And, um, let's see. Yes, yeah, strength. Go. Oh, and then I'll head for the other section after. What? I saw elf ears. Ah! Edit attachment! Um. Wrote. Oops. No, rotate. Nope, 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 nope. Reset. Nope, no! I keep pressing L3 instead of R3. Um, uh, rotate. Uh, Z axis rotation. Nope. Reset. Oh, that just. Wait. Yes. Uh, Y angle rotation? Oh, it just totally moves the ears as a set? I thought, well, that's stupid. So if I do it like that, she could have elf. Wow. No, reset that. Okay, so I guess we'll just stick them with elf ears. Um, I can make them bigger or smaller, but I kind of like the size that they are right now. Elf ears. Elf ears. We're all elves now. <laughs> this is life. <laughs> um. Yeah, you need to play Jude, his side of the story, while Mita route only focus on- Yeah, I want to know Jude's side of the story, too. In Jude's route, you'll know what he and the others are doing while we watch Mita's perspective. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's why I want to play his right after I finish, um, her route. Um, did I not get an- I'm not gonna talk to Alvin first. Where's the girl who wanted the insect husk? 
I got so many. Isn't that perfect for you? Color, shape, condition, everything is perfect. I'll offer at the shrine right away. Isn't this wonderful, Lord Maxwell? Now you have another specimen for your insect husk collection. Don't worry, Lord Maxwell. I won't tell your companions that you have such an unusual hobby. Oh, okay. <gasps> Bedhead! <gasps> Bed Bedhead! Bedhead! <laughs> what? You can't tell on her. Wait. Bed, bedhead. Is it just that one antenna that pops up? Oh my gosh, it's just that one antenna. Oh, that's lame. Oh! No! My- Ah! My dragon! Oh, that's dangerous. Elf ears. That means I should, um, register this. Yes. Shoot, that's dangerous. Register. I lost- Oh! <gasps> Wait, no, what? Why is her- No. Oh, it's cause I got rid of her bed- mm -hmm. Damn it. I have to change everything again. Oh. Resize. Uh, position on her... Uh... Where was it? Head, neck... I think I put it on her neck. And I... Uh... No? Uh, move horizontally... There we go. Change depth. Changed up. Nope. This way. Why did her bowel get reset? That's so stupid. Ah. Uh, I think move horizontally again. Okay. Rotate. Y. Oops. Y axis. X axis. X axis. Z axis. X axis. Uh. X axis. This way. Z axis again. X axis. And now Y axis. Yes. Uh, Z axis back this way. There we go. Move that this way. Resize to be super big. Move to change the depth again. Uh, yes. Uh, rotate. Maybe I can. So that the tail isn't just like super stuck against her. Yeah. Yes. And then move it back closer to her chest. Yes. And then change color. Want a more pinkish. Pink it. Nope. There we go. Okay. Finish. And we register this. There we go. That freaking scared me! I lost all my progress with that. Register. Register. Yes. Okay. I wonder why hers got reset and the boys didn't. Weird. Do I have a Napple in my inventory? Can I just talk to the kid and give it to him? Where was he? Also, it's so freaking hot in my room. Why? It's not even that hot today. Oh, kid! Napple kid, where are you? Napple kid? Oh, he was near the entrance. I mean, the exit on the other side. It wasn't you. It wasn't you. How do I get out of here? Oh, there you are. Wait, Napple Kid isn't here. Oh, this is Napple Kid. Yay, you brought me an apple. Thanks, Lord Maxwell. These are so good, you won't even believe it. It does look quite appetizing. They're really good. Really, truly, incredibly good. So, so good. Mita. Mmm, yes, you're right. Here, I want you to have this. But I got it for you. And I'm sure it tastes wonderful, but it's okay. Thanks, Lord Maxwell. 
Here, you can have this instead. Drippy nose? What? Y'all are killing me! Um... I'm so afraid. There's an apple in the shack. Um... Never mind. <laughs> I didn't think I had an apple in my inventory, but thank goodness I did. Um, what's Drippy nose? Ew, gross! Ew. I don't like Drippy nose. Uh, okay. Speak with the elder about Alvin's fees. Okay, elder, where are you? I guess next time I get quests like that, I should just be like. Um, I should just talk to them immediately, because I'll most likely have the items. Where's the elder's house? Where's the elder? This is Ivar's house. Let's see if he's in. He's in! Hello. Cleaning to shrine, organizing the offerings, composing peons to Mita, writing Mita my observation diary. Wait, writing my Mita observation diary. A true handmaid's work is never done. He's the handmaid! When she said handmaid, I thought it was a lady. Hmm. How did he get chosen to become Mira's handmaid? Assembly hall? Oh, wait, now what do you want? You're not the elder, are you? Or are you the elder? Oh, you are. Hello. Lord Maxwell, and your companions. Forgive me for making you wait. But I'm too poor and I cannot pay his fees. I hear you've prepared payment for Alvin. Yes, yes. The villagers all pitched in and collected a small fund ages ago. And someone stole it. It's the least we can do to help you, Lord Maxwell. You hear farmers, not fighters, after all. I see. Told you. I appreciate everything you've done for me. So my debt is paid. Thank you for everything. Don't leave me, Alvin. Yeah, thanks. It was fun. See you around. No, don't leave! And just like that, he's gone. Why are you leaving me? That's a mercenary for you, I suppose. Yeah. Lady Mila. What is it, dude? Will you be departing again? Yes. Look after the village. But I would rather accompany you. No, I don't want you to. I wouldn't dare leave your holy care in the hands of this blasphemous, uncouth, shifty, backstabbing stranger! How am I a backstabber? Ivor, tell me again of your duty. My duty? Why, it is to serve you, Lady Mila. And, and what serve me duty? by listening to me. <laughs> uh, to protect the people of Niakara. Those who can't protect themselves. Exactly. And now you see why Jude shall accompany me on this journey. <laughs> Cutie While you pie! you your second duty. But Lady Mila, you wouldn't have lost the great spirits if not for him. I helped her get out of there, dude! No, the fault was mine and mine alone. Indeed, if Jude hadn't been there. I might never have returned safely to Nia Kara. Thank you. Thanks. I'm only trying to help. But Lady Mila! But shut your face, dude. The matter is not open to debate. Will you abandon your duty to this village? No. Then let's be off, Jude. I hope they haven't closed off the Sea Haven. So does that mean we'll be passing through Hamil again on the way? Hmm. Was Hamil the farming idea. town? Really? Is that okay? It will give us a chance to check up on Rashagal's activity here in Ajul. If we're lucky, 
We might even find a way to sneak into Fenmon. Gotcha. We'll stop by Hamil then. No, don't talk about all this because then Ivar's gonna show up and be like, Hoo -hoo, I'm here to help you. To you Lord Maxwell. Uh, Thank you. And then our town's gonna be under attack and then, uh. Lady Mila, please return to us safely. Never mind. Okay. He's just gonna stay here. Please don't do anything dumb, Ivar. Ah, the meat at list. <laughs> hey, Artsy, how are you doing? Thanks for joining. Please. Tissue ready. Oh! That's the town where she is. Oh, I want to get her. I want to get her now. Um, Head to Hamil. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go rescue her. I really wish there was the option to have Japanese voices. Even for one character, and I'd be like, give it to me to... <sighs> Does Tales of Zillia 2 have um, Japanese voices, or is it still just English? Probably just English, huh? Because it's um, PS3 era. So, that woman is supposed to be Maxwell? And you claim she has lost her powers, Pressa. <laughs> Cat lady! Yes. If she's already hidden the key somewhere, we could have a problem. The fault is mine. I underestimated them. <gasps> I apologize. Yellow! Yellow coat dude! He's evil! He was there! He was there, um, trying to hide Elise. Yep, no duolato. Damn it. Still the same, no lisp though? Ah. <laughs> if I'd only known that woman was Maxwell, I would have forced her to reveal the key's whereabouts. No matter. It is in our best interest to let her wander freely for now. Yes. Let her attract the attention of Rashigal while we quietly put all the pieces in place. Any word from Agria? She says they appear to have decided to construct a new key to replace the one they lost. Agria? Who's Agria? We cannot ignore that. Zhao, you no longer need to watch over the girl. Join the search for the key. But, sir... If the Rashigal soldiers have withdrawn, you need not monitor her personally. It only makes sense for priorities to change. The data is safe, after all. As you say... Pressa, rendezvous with Agria and infiltrate Fenmont. This is my favorite Tales game along with Zillia 2. Vesperia is a close second. Ooh, right now, so far, since I completed Vesperia, uh, that's my favorite one. Agria, the psycho girl in red at the beginning. Oh, that's her name. Okay, oh, okay. So it's truly oh, safe look, it's Lightning's voice. Well alone? She sounds so much better as Pressa than she does at li as Lightning. I don't know, with lightning, it sounded just so flat, like she was trying to be, like, bored, and I'm like, ugh. Yes, we still have another pawn on the board. I'll have him search or for more the like keys Zaggy. well. It is like, yeah, you're right, KB. Lightning sounded soulless, yeah, that's why I could not stand the English voice. But I was like, I want to have English voice for at least Snow, because he was Troy Baker. But, ugh. But in the end, Japanese won out because, uh, what's her- Sakamoto Maya was Lightning, and, um, uh, Kajiyuki was Hope. So now I was like, well, playing in Japanese! What is it? I was mulling over our options. What if we can't take a boat straight to Fenma? Well... I vote against taking the land route from Aljul. Crossing the mountains would be a real pain. Alvin, you're still here. Alvin? Alvin? We could head towards Sherrilton from Sapstrath Sea Haven. We? What do you mean, we? That handmaid of yours offered me a little job. He wasn't so crazy about his exalted spirit traveling with a pipsqueak for a protector. Plus, I need to move Bao closer to Mita's body. Professional pride if I didn't give them their money's worth. He's too far. <laughs> Very well. Good to have you back. Welcome back, yeah. Alvin! Thanks for coming along. And you couldn't leave for long. 
Even though you're gonna backstab me. The villagers, not me. So, what's the plan? First, we head to Hamil to investigate Rashigal's movements. Uh. Wait, I missed a lot of. Ooh. Like five? Who's? F oh, five from Drakengard. Yeah, it was weird. I hated it. If you played near Automata, two B sounded like lightning, but better. I could not play Automata in English. I'm sorry, I could not. They had. They seem to have more emotion and feeling with the Japanese voices. If still there, that is. Kajiyuki's awesome. He's in everything. Yes, I love his voice. Oh, he's so good. Should have let Five's English voice cat girl. Then you better take mm -hmm. this. And you Android having more emotion than case. lightning says something. For real. You can trust Alvin? I don't trust Alvin. He feels like the shady person. Should well, I, I have to meet the rest of the cast, too. But so far, it's always been the older males that have backstabbed me. In Vesperia, it was Raven. In Grace's, it was Malik. even though he didn't really betray us. He was just fighting on the army side. And now I feel like it's gonna be Alvin. I got a world map! While traveling around, press RD to open the world map. From there, you can instantly return to locations you've already- <gasps> New discoveries may be in old places. Of course, depending on where you are in the story, you may not always be able to visit certain locations. Yo! Then I could just zip zap zoop to Hamil. Heck yes! Ah! Hi. The road this way to lead to Oe. The girl was in here. Elise was in here. Elise! Wait, story mana. I don't get it. How could the four great spirits get captured? Fundamentally, the four are masses of mana. The Lance of Kresnik absorbs mana and apparently is able to store it. I never thought that was even possible. Apparently it is. We have to go rescue the four then. I do like the pluck, but this might be a case where a bit of pluck will get you a lot of dead. A pissed off med student's probably not a tall order for the group that bagged the four great spirits. <laughs> Which is why we need more party members. Doors locked, height can't be opened. Well then, how am I gonna get her out? Uh, he has a good reason though, Alvin. <laughs> Uh, they that's what I don't like about the betrayers. They always seem to have a good reason to betray you and I'm just like You're making it really hard for me to hate you Although Raven I didn't like him because he was sleazy Not because he betrayed me What about Tales of the Abyss? Have you played? I have not played Abyss. So far I've only played Vesperia and Graces to com completion and now I'm doing Zillia 1 and 2 Uh I already know about the betrayal character, mm -hmm, but not why. Yeah, I don't know the whys of why they betray me. Honestly, I wanted to play Nier Automata in Japanese, but I wanted to enjoy it to its fullest, so I decided to go for English because I wasn't in the mood to read subs. Ah, uh, okay, understandable. Where do you go after you left the shrine in Nia Kara? That's a secret for grown-ups. It sounds like you're trying to hide something. Figured that out, did you? Do you want to ask what I was doing? If you don't want to tell me, that's fine. He's pouting. If it's fine with you, then I ain't telling. No, tell me! You don't want to tell me? You don't want to ask? I'm starting to think I'd rather not know. I'm starting to think you're probably right. <laughs> See, when when Alvin banters like that with Jude, I'm like, Alvin, you're not a bad guy. But I think he is a bad guy. He is the bad guy. I, I'm not hiding anything. I promise. No! Tell me about Elise. I caught one gold. Um, head to Hamil. I am here. Now what do I do? I can't believe outsiders found out about that girl. This could be trouble. <gasps> yes, tell me more. Tell me more. Did she put up a fight? Don't be bringing the war between Rashigal and Aljul to our little frontier town. I didn't. They followed me. Like creeps. I never imagined that I'd see the Rashigal army in a place like this. Hmm. Where is Elise? 
Where is Elise? Give me Elise. Please. Uh, I'm more sub than dub, but if it's something that's all about the rage, I'll go for dubbed. Hmm. No, it's hard. Like, quit being nice. I know! Alvin, stop making it so hard for me to hate you. I don't really hate him. I'm just wary of him. At least it's part of the story. Carry on. <clears throat> but I want to find her right now! I'm so impatient! Eastern District. Give me the girl. Oh, I forgot to move Bal closer to her body. Whoops. <gasps> Why are they yelling at her? She's just a little this girl. Is your fault, you evil brat. Don't you dare. Why? Don't stop it. I don't understand adults who pick on little kid children. It's like they're kids. Yeah, they do! What's the big idea? <laughs> you okay? <laughs> do you have any idea what you people put us through? Oh wow, she's mad at us now. When we first came in, she was all nice and happy. Is this Rashigal's doing? They couldn't find us, so they took it out on the village. Leave here at once! You outsiders are nothing but trouble! She was like a completely different person. No, come back! Please! Let's see if the villagers know anything about Rashigal's activities. Don't forget, we'll be leaving soon. We should take Elise gotcha. with us. Thank you. Alvin, you know what's up. You know what's up! You led them to us. Alvin, I know what you did! The Rostergal soldiers came back and did even more damage. My own child was seriously injured. Why did this have to happen? Because people are jerks. I'm not supposed to talk to outsiders, so when I ask if you guys found any of Ifrit's treasures, that's just me talking to myself, okay? Well, I did find some. Uh, anyone to talk to over here? Nah. Hello people, talk to me. Or don't. Hi! A strange stuffed animal. Sorry, afraid there's nothing like that in this village. Huh? Chief Zhao drove off the Rashigal soldiers for us, but now we have to worry that they'll come back for revenge. That, this is exactly why I said we don't want anything to do with any outsider business. But he's betraying you guys! He's working with the bad guys! Ugh. They told me I should try to be friends with that girl, but... I guess I just knew it would end up being trouble for me if I got involved. We did... We only did what Zhao asked us to do. I don't know any more than that, and I don't want to know any more than that. Zhao made his own people get hurt? Just for the sake of... Oh my gosh, what a jerk. Shop expansion? Blah. I don't need shop expansion talk. Uh, yeah, I know this too. Can I expand? Mmm. Fish. Ton of fish. Yeah, level 14. How about that? Uh, armor shop. Donate ores. Yeah. Level 7? Oh wow, that doesn't do a lot. Ooh. Okay. Yay! Um... 
Accessories. I guess I did do accessories. What was accessories? Birds. Eight. Yes. Warrior emblem. Magic emblem. Fire emblem. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. Um, plants. Oh whoa! I missed a lot of chat. Whoops. Um. I wanted to hate him, but I couldn't. Like, they make it super obvious on purpose. <laughs> Alden! Jew's root was, wow, what? Alvin! <laughs> Elise burned his town. Like, the way they were picking on her, it reminded me of um, Kaina from Nier. And I'm just like, stop! She's just a child! Like, leave her alone. They all deserve to die. I hope a plague spreads. What do you think of the opening theme? I think it's one of the few um, as opening themes in Tales. I forgot what the opening theme is for. Whoops. I don't care about updates, Adobe. Leave me alone. Um, I think Irvine is the only character no one likes. Who's Irvine? Irvine. Irvine. Is he in this game? I don't remember Irvine. Huh. Oh, Ivar? Yeah, I I don't like him much either. <laughs> Fish. I don't really need food. Um. Ooh, yes. Wait, Jude left my party, but this is probably stronger for him because it's new. I'll buy it, buy it, buy it. Yes. Ah, oh, shoot! Now I'm dirt poor. Whoops. Should I sell old weapons? Do I need them for synthesis? Uh, you'd be surprised later. Can't even remember his name. Yeah, because he's so unlikable. Um, should I sell all of my old weapons? Is there anything like weapon synthesis in this game? I mean, I've been playing this for a while and it hasn't come up, so I'm assuming no. Uh, I I want to sell them. I need, I want money. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it. Let's sell it. Ron's helm. Really? That raises defense for Alvin? What? Uh. You're only wearing a leather helm this entire time? The heck? What the heck, dude? Okay, anyways, let's keep attacking. Money can be a struggle in this game? Ugh. Then should I get the DLC that gives me extra money? <laughs> okay, yeah. I can't talk to outsiders. Mayor's orders. Well, let me punch the mayor in the face. How about that? Hmm. Scram! Your kind isn't welcome here. Hey, I didn't betray you. Your chief did, okay? Scram? What happened to the down-home hospitality you showed us when we got here? <laughs> Worry not. We'll soon be on our way. But if you keep acting like that, we just might have to stay here longer. Alvin. What do you want from me? I want to know what happened to Rashigal's forces. Have they left? <laughs> Chief Zhao drove them off. Chief Zhao? Let me guess. Big guy? Funky beard? Yes. Things could have gotten a lot worse if not for him. Hmm. So what happened to this Chief Zhao of yours? Don't ask me. We've been living a nightmare here ever since he brought that accursed girl with him. We'll take her off your hands. He should have taken her with him when he left. In any case, we're through with outsiders here. <gasps> I got Elise! Hey, there you are. Oh, so in Jude's route, I can see, um... I can see him talking with Elise then. Ah! Um, I can't remember either, but I know in Zilli 2 you need your old weapons and armors to upgrade. Punch her in the gooch. <laughs> oh, 
Uh, the girl? I wish I could, but I'm too nice. <laughs> I personally ship him and Elise. Jude and Elise? Oh. We're finished here. We didn't learn anything useful. It's time to go. Eh. <laughs> Wait, we need to talk. It's about the girl. They're like three years apart. She's only three years younger than Jute. She's 15? She does not look 15. Now the villagers do seem to treat her like a pariah. Jude and Lit. What? Ah, there's another girl? <gasps> I get another girl? Until that big fellow Jow returns. 15 going on 30. <laughs> Jude is. He's only 16? I thought he was 18 for some reason. Jude is 16. Mita is 20. Alvin is. I have no idea how old he is. So Elise is 13, huh? But Elise insists Jow isn't her friend. Yeah, he kept her locked up in the shed basement. He locks her up when he's around, and the villagers treat her horribly when he's away. Sounds like she's stuck between a jerk and a hard place. Unless we bring her with us. Bring her with us? And then what? Have you given this any thought? You do remember my mission. She can help! Yeah. Oh, Jude, you're so cute. <sighs> Very well. She can come. Really? Jude, do you remember what I told you at the falls? Huh? When? I don't remember. Be yourself and do what you have to do. That's what I said to you. Yeah. I remember. Those words still apply. Can I assume your decision to bring the girl is just another step in your path? That it will help you find the answer you seek? Y yes. <laughs> sure, whatever, Mita. <laughs> then tell Elise she's coming. You got it. Yay, new party member, get! That was nice of you. She won't affect my mission. If she slows me down or gets herself in trouble, I'll just leave her behind. My intent from the beginning was to do this alone after all. Maybe I should move Alvin's bandage back to his nose. Party members changed! Oh, uh, she's only a guest, damn it. Uh, bandage. And an attachment. Position. Uh, resets. Yes. Uh, wait, position. Default. Wait, what? Yeah. And let me... Wait, how did I... Arch. And rotate. Move, change depth. Oops. Ah! Undo any adjustments you made. Yes. This. Yes. Uh, remove this. Put this back on. There we go. Uh, edit attachment. I'll just change the color. To be a yellow. Uh, there we go. Uh, custom set register. Ah. There we go. Oh, wait. Move her bowel closer. And a detachment. Move. Change depth. There we go. Now it's closer. Save. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, there's people out there that ship Alvin and Lee's. Ew, why? Honestly, it's best you don't play this game in Japanese. Jude's voice is pretty weird. Huh. I don't even... I didn't look up who his um, Japanese voice actor is. 
And yes, in Jude's route, you'll see him in Elise's cutscene. Ah! Alvin's only 20. Alvin's only 20? Why does he look so old? I thought he was like late 20s, early 30s. Damn! So 20, 18, 16. Wait, 20, 20, 16, 13. Holy crap. I wish my PS3 wasn't dead. I want to play this game again. <laughs> Wait, Alvin's 26? Oh my gosh. 26. 20. 16. Oh, so Jude and Alvin are 10 years apart. Maybe that's why they're so like chummy, like brothers. How's egg principle? If you leave an egg in an empty box and said egg gets crushed, the cause must lie within the egg itself. How's egg principle? It sounds obvious, but at the same time, not so much. 500 years ago, Professor Howe used that principle to deduce how spirit channeling works. Although, people still channeled beforehand, right? They just didn't know what they were doing. Yeah. Since spirits have no apparent physical form, people weren't aware they existed at all. But Professor Howe surmised that something had to be converting the mana from our mana lobes into arts. And that turned out to be spirits. Yep. His hypothesis was proven with the discovery of spirits that had taken physical forms. And because he figured out what was inside the egg, the age of spirit arts was born. Exactly. Although there's still a lot we don't understand about spirits. Like Maxwell being a busty 20-year-old. <laughs> Bet even Professor Howe didn't see that coming. Uh, where am I going now? Head to Aladi Sea Haven. What do we do? Judas voiced by Tsubasa Yonaga? I have never heard of that person. Huh. <gasps> Please! She still waves to them, even though they threw rocks at her. Oh, but the kids were nice to her, at least. Hmm. Like, what did she do that was so terrible that all the villagers, like, all the adults hate her? Because all the kids still played with her. So weird. Okay. Ooh, Ivar's duties. Oh boy. That handmaid of yours is a piece of work. He voiced Nagisa from Free. Oh my gosh, that voice for Jude? Oh no. Oh no. She loves Nickelback and all the adults are not about that life. <laughs> I don't value his temper, but he is quite skilled. Oh, maybe they didn't like that doll? Hmm, I don't know. He said he's been serving you for years. Yes, he cleans up the shrine, he runs errands, always with a lot of enthusiasm. He buys my clothes and arranges them into outfits. So he dressed her like this. What? Okay. Wow, your handmaid has exquisite taste. Yes, the clothes are very comfortable. I quite like them. The crisscrossing ribbons have to be so uncomfortable, though. An awkward introduction. Oh, I guess I haven't properly introduced Elise yet. I'm Elise Ludis. Hello. Well, you look like you'll be a fine lady when you grow up. I'm Alvin. It's nice to meet you. I, um, well... Huh? Don't talk to strangers, Elise. Strangers are bad. It talks. Maybe talking demon doll. Oh my gosh, it talks! Alvin, please, don't be flirty to a kid. Stranger danger! Yeah, she's 13 years your junior. Ugh. Why is this stuffed animal talking? Huh? Tipo always talks. Naturally! Tipo's kind of cute, actually. Oh, so I'm the one who's reacting strangely? Sure looks that way! <laughs> I'm arguing with the stuffed animal. How unusual. Unusual, she says. Coming from you, Mila? <laughs> Everyone's getting chubby! 
Okay, the reason why I'm not instantly teleporting is I want to see if Elise joins battle. She does not. Far too easy. Heck yeah, too easy. Okay. Um. Ooh boy, Tipo is quite the character. The best part of the game. Wait until you get to the best game in the game ever. <sighs> I can't wait for more skits. Um. Where am I going? A lot of Sea Haven. I'm just fast traveling there. Let's save since I got Elise. It'll take ten, ten more hours. <gasps> oh my gosh! Why is there no music here? The head chef said I need to learn how to make soda rice. Unfortunately, I don't have the first clue how to go about it. Could you help me? Thank you. If I can eat it just once, I should be able to figure out how to make it. Didn't I buy soda rice? Huh, so this is soda rice. Oh, I see. They use miso as a secret ingredient to balance the soda and rice flavors. What? Miso? To... What? Ew. Thanks, now I'll be able to grow and improve as a chef. Wait, I didn't get anything from that. What? Wait, no, I got bushy- <gasps> Bushy eyebrows! Bushy eyebrows! Oh my gosh, yes! <gasps> yes! <laughs> Give me them thick eyebrows. <laughs> You don't like gross salty soda? <laughs> no. Uh, depending on how much of a completionist you are. Well, since I'm streaming, I'm not gonna go for like 100% completion now. I'm gonna do that on my off time after I play tons of games. Rock Lee, heck yes! Rock Lee was such a good boy. But Shikamaru was my favorite Naruto character. More monsters have taken up residence at the lake west of the Sea Haven. I asked the local mercenary to take care of them, but I'm afraid the monsters got to her. Could you go to the lake and rescue her, please? Heck yes, for I am strong. Um, wait, let me take a look at my titles. Oop, not battle book, titles. Um, gather item data, I don't know what that means. Sub-event starter, regular skip viewer... Finder, look, loot liker. No, where's the one with the food? Food. Food. Ah, I can't wait to get this. Uh, food. I know there's food titles. Foodie. Okay. Utilize the effects of food. A hundred. Well, damn. I guess I have to buy more food. Uh, weapons, armors, accessories. Where's the food, dude? Items. Maybe items will have food. And yet, yeah, why is there still no um, music in here? Wait, west. So... Oh wait, I gotta go out of here. Need to go west? Yeah. West to the lake, and then I can save the lady. Oh shoot, I've been streaming for two hours! Yeah, after I save this lady, um, I'll call it a night. Jet Black Feather! Whoa! Two monsters! But she eyebrows are a turn on for me. <laughs> I like, yeah, like thicker eyebrows are more preferable than thinner eyebrows to me. Isn't it a bit, well, too short? No, isn't that great? And unrestricted. I guess so. <laughs> Should I change their eyebrow colors to match their hair color? Oh, you're following me. Hi. Watch out! It's 
I love the bushy eyebrows. Oh, man. There's such a great attachment. Oh. Much better than that bandage. Bandage was kind of boring. Get it. I hope I'm going the right way. The name's Alvin. Don't, Don't you, you forget it. Uh, Jude and Alvin's links arts are great. Have you tried? Um, no. So my plan is while I'm playing uh, Mita's route, I'm just gonna mostly control her and do all of her um linked stuff. And then when I played Jude's route, I'm gonna mostly control Jude. Uh, did you ever play Soccer Frontier? I have not. I've heard of it. Um, aren't they, like, remaking it for Switch or something? I think I've seen posts from the Square Enix Instagram account about it. And it originally came out for PlayStation, right? Alright, I just want the stuff. That's the case and I'm getting only if it's the first one. I don't... I have to double check, but I'm pretty sure they're they're coming out with a remake or something. Wait, where was this lake? West Branch, yeah. Where were the enemies? Was it more up here? Hi. Um, what got you into Tails games? Um, KV suggested it. <laughs> Far too easy. Yeah, how did this come up? Me playing Tails games. Oh no, I came from there. What am I doing? I'm going the wrong way. Ah, hi. I don't know how we started talking about Tails games. But then I was like, oh, I'll check it out because like my friend played it in college. She was playing um no matter what She was playing Symphonia. And so I was like, oh, I heard of Tails. Maybe I'll pick it up too. Saga has multiple characters with different arcs. They kind of have overlaps. Huh. Which reminded me of... Mm. I used to play Suikoden too, and like, um, the third game, it had, um, three different characters that you can control in the beginning. And so you saw the point of view of the entire first half of the game from each of their perspectives and then later on they all joined and then it just became one point of view. But I really liked Sweet Code in 3. Even though 1 and 2 were more epic. I told you to try it out but I don't remember how the conversation started. Yeah, I don't remember how the conversation started too but I'm so glad that I'm playing it. It's so fun. Alright! Thanks, a little longer and I would have been dinner. You guys look like you know how to fight. Just don't let your guard down like I did. Of course I won't, because I'm awesome. Let's teleport back to there to get my reward. Uh, I only played two. I haven't played either, been curious. Yeah, I think Sweet Coden only has five games total. Sweet Coden won... Actually, no. All first four games, I think, are like back to back. They link to wait. Yes, first four games, they take place right after each other sequentially. And then fifth game, I don't know when it takes place in the universe, but it's like totally different new characters. Totally different world. Because in the first four games, there are a couple of characters that do overlap and you see them again in multiple games. Uh, I played a bit of Soccer Frontier but never finished it. That was decades ago. I remember they run super fast in the world map. Hmm. I will- maybe I'll look more to Soccer Frontier too. You rescued her, thank you! Sheathed dagger? As a goggle? What? Huh, what's that? 
sheath dagger. Wait. Boo, that's boring. Boo, that sucks. Give me my elf ears. Okay. So what's keeping this Tipo thing floating in the air like that? Who knows? Sheer talent, I guess. Wait. No, I can't have Elise as my control uh, player that I'm controlling because she's only a guest right now. Save. They're like a few hours per storyline, like five to seven, because there's six or so characters you can choose from. Some with even shorter storylines. It's fun. Huh, okay, I'm really gonna look up Soccer Frontier now and see if there is a remake coming for Switch. Because that seems interesting. I love seeing stories from different points of view from other characters, because it's like, this is how it affected them. This is why they're acting like this towards you. Which is why I like um, Fire Emblem Three Houses, because it's like, oh, wait, the, like we're playing the story from this house's point of view, but like if we play the other houses, we'll see their motivations and their interactions their reasonings so i really like it oh but anyways i need to go sleep now so thanks for watching and i'll see you next time stay toasty have a good night everyone bye bye dimitri does not suck dimitri is good boy he 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 got tortured a lot he a lot of things happened to him it was not his fault but anyways good night bye